channel. Today we will share information about around the sea world. Let's explore the sea. Manta ray. Manta rays are large rays belonging to the genus Mobula, formerly its own genus Manta. The larger species, M. barostris, reaches 7 meters in width, while the smaller, M. alfredi, reaches 5.5 meters. Both have triangular pectoral fins, horn-shaped cephalic fins and large, forward-facing mouths. They are classified among the Myliobatiformes and are placed in the family Myliobatidae, eagle rays. They have the largest brains and brain-to-body ratio of all fish, and can pass the mirror test. Mantas are found in warm temperate, subtropical and tropical waters. Both species are pelagic. M. barostris migrates across open oceans, singly or in groups, while M. alfredi tends to be resident and coastal. They are filter feeders and eat large quantities of zooplankton, which they gather with their open mouths as they swim. However, research suggests that the majority of their diet actually comes from mesopelagic sources. Gestation lasts over a year and mantas give birth to live pups. Mantas may visit cleaning stations for the removal of parasites. Like whales, they breach for unknown reasons. Both species are listed as vulnerable by the International Union for Conservation of Nature. Anthropogenic threats include pollution, entanglement in fishing nets, and direct harvesting of their gill rakers for use in Chinese medicine. Their slow reproductive rate exacerbates these threats. They are protected in international waters by the Convention on Migratory Species of Wild Animals, but are more vulnerable closer to shore. Areas where mantas congregate are popular with tourists. Only a few public aquariums are large enough to house them. Etymology The name, manta, is Portuguese and Spanish for mantle, cloak or blanket, a type of blanket-shaped trap traditionally used to catch rays. Mantas are known as, devil fish, because of their horn-shaped cephalic fins, which are imagined to give them an, evil, appearance. Taxonomy Manta rays are members of the order Myliobatiformes, which consists of stingrays and their relatives. The genus Manta is part of the Myliobatidae, where it is grouped in the subfamily Mobulinae along with the smaller Mobula devil rays. In 2018, an analysis of DNA, and to a lesser degree, morphology, found that Mobula was paraphyletic with respect to the Manta rays. That is, some members of genus Mobula are closer related to the members of the genus Manta than they are to fellow Mobula. Mantas evolved from bottom-dwelling stingrays, eventually developing more wing-like pectoral fins. The mouths of most rays lie on the underside of the head, while in mantas, they are right at the front. The edges of the jaws line up while in devil rays, the lower jaw shifts back when the mouth closes. Manta rays and devil rays are the only ray species that have evolved into filter feeders. Manta rays have dorsal slit-like spiracles, traits which they share with the devil fish and Chilean devil ray. Species 
The scientific naming of mantas has had a convoluted history, during which several names were used for both the genus and species. All were eventually treated as synonyms of the single species Manta barostris. The genus name Manta was first published in 1829 by Dr. Edward Nathaniel Bancroft of Jamaica. The specific name Barostris is ascribed to Johann Julius Wolbaum by some authorities and to Johann August Dondorf by others. The specific name Alfredi was first used by Australian zoologist Gerard Kreft, who named the Manta after Prince Alfred. A 2009 study analyzed the differences in morphology, including color, meristic variation, dermal denticles, and teeth of different populations. Two distinct species emerged, the smaller M. alfredi found in the Indo-Pacific and tropical East Atlantic, and the larger M. barostris found throughout tropical, subtropical and warm temperate oceans. The former is more coastal, while the latter is more ocean-going and migratory. A 2010 study on mantas around Japan confirmed the morphological and genetic differences between M. barostris and M. alfredi. A third possible species, preliminarily called Manta sp. C.F. Barostris, reaches at least 6 meters in width, and inhabits the tropical West Atlantic. Life cycle Mating takes place at different times of the year in different parts of the Manta's range. Courtship is difficult to observe in this fast-swimming fish, although mating, trains, with multiple individuals. Swimming closely behind each other are sometimes seen in shallow water. The mating sequence may be triggered by a full moon and seems to be initiated by a male following closely behind a female while she travels at around 10 km per hour. He makes repeated efforts to grasp her pectoral fin with his mouth, which may take 20 to 30 minutes. Once he has a tight grip, he turns upside down and presses his ventral side against hers. He then inserts one of his claspers into her cloaca, where it remains for 60 to 90 seconds. The claspers form a tube and a siphon propels semen from the genital papilla into the oviduct. The male continues to grip the female's pectoral fin with his teeth for a further few minutes as both continue to swim. Often followed by up to 20 other males. The pair then parts, the female being left with scars on her fin. watching this video don't forget to like comment share and subscribe this channel see you later